I'm Sienna Murphy and I'm a senior from UW Platteville and I'm a marketing intern here at Unified Therapy Services. And how did you learn about the position? I learned about the position because it was posted on Dubuque Access um, or accessdubuquejobs.com. And tell us about your role and some tasks that you perform within the organization. Um, as the marketing intern here for UTS, I perform a lot of different tasks that have to do with PR, marketing, advertising, and social media. So I help write press releases and design flyers and different marketing material for UTS and post to the Facebook page about different events that we have coming up. So I get to work on a really wide range of different um, hands-on things that all have to do with my degree, so that's great. And what kind of skills have you learned throughout your internship? Um, well, because I'm a PR major, um, it's been great because I get to do a lot of different things that are more on the marketing advertising side. So just watching uh, Sarah and Julie design different things for you know advertisements for UTS has been a really great experience because I get to kind of have both sides of um, the PR and marketing and advertising and then also just just basic things like creating their website and creating um, social media content for their Facebook page and just being involved in planning their events and just assisting with different things that they have going on on a day-to-day -day basis. And why did you choose to intern for Unified Therapy Services? Well, after just my first meeting here, I was just really attracted to UTS because I could see that Sarah was really happy and excited and motivated to work here. And after just getting a quick tour of the facility, I knew that working here as a marketing intern was just going to be a completely unique experience that nobody else was you know, going to get to have. So I was really excited. Do you have any advice to students who are looking for an internship? My advice to students looking for an internship would be to just seek something out that that is going to challenge you and that might not be exactly what you what you think you were going to do, but maybe just something that's a little bit broader that you can get a variety of different things with hands-on experience with just everything that has to do with your degree and seek something unique and challenging. Thank you. My name is Audrey Decker. I am a speech language pathologist at Unified Therapy Services, and I graduated with my master's from the University of Northern Iowa. I did my internship at University or at Unified Therapy Services in the summer of 2012. And how did you learn about the position? I actually did some observation hours as an undergraduate, that was one of our requirements to go outside of our university. And I was looking through the phone book and I found Unified Therapy Services and I decided to do observation hours. And that's when I really fell in love with just the atmosphere, the environment, the kids and everything that were here. Um, can you tell us a little bit about the tasks and different the role that you performed within your internship when you were interning here? I actually had all of the duties uh, as my supervisor, the speech pathologist that I was working under, and that included writing up reports, it included therapy, doing, you know, thinking of goals, implementing the goals, um, pretty much everything that she was doing. I kind of took all of that over by the end of my internship. And what kind of skills did you learn throughout your internship? I learned, well, there was a little bit of a, a mix-up with who my supervisor was going to be there. I think the day before I started, my supervisor, who was supposed to be my supervisor, actually had her baby. So I learned what flexibility means, and it really taught me to not stress over the little things because, you know, it's all going to get done and to just roll with the flow, go with the punches. And how did your intern experience help you secure a full-time job within Unified Therapy Services? It was very nice for me because I kind of got to try out the job before I started. And then it was nice for Unified Therapy Services to kind of see how I worked with the kids and worked with the staff and the families of the clients. So it was kind of a just a really nice experience 
to, for both of us to see how we work together and if it was a good fit, and it was. Thank you. My name is Maggie Bernroy. I went to school, my undergrad was at Illinois Wesleyan University, got my bachelor's in psychology, and I did my graduate work at St. Louis University, and that's actually where I met Sarah Sievers, who does HR here and marketing, and she had um, a booth, and it was one of the only pediatric booths, so I went and talked to her, and I think I got pushed by my friend, but um, talked to her and learned about the clinic, and I actually changed my student rotation to come up here, because I'm from St. Louis, so the far drive, I never would have been in Iowa <laughs> otherwise, so I came up and I did my three month rotation, which is basically full-time work, and as an occupational therapist, I work with kids with special needs, who work on handwriting, daily self-help skills, um, just even if there's behaviors, lots of things like that. But we did, basically did the whole full-time work under the supervision of my clinical instructor, who was full-time here at the time. So um, did the full-time work, did the the midterm and the final and finally finished and I did an interview before I went back home. And I interviewed because I was already big comfortable here, I really liked the area and knew that I felt at home in this area and in this clinic. So came back and got hired and I've been here ever since. Do you have any advice for students who are just like you and looking for an internship in this field? Yeah, I would say it's important to if you need to make a change, a lot of these internships are set by your school, and it's important to go check them out first. I wouldn't just go with what you're told. Um, it's important to get a feel for it, and if it doesn't feel quite right, find something else so that you, that student time is really important. You only get, for me, two three-month rotations, so you either get it or you don't, and if you don't, you're going into full-time work without the full exposure to what you really like and figuring out who you like to work with, what kind of setting you like, and those things are really important. Thank you. Mm -hmm.